Good evening friends and welcome back to my kitchen. So tonight we are actually making something for tomorrow morning. I'm going to be making our baked French toast and I'm going to be adding a little something, pumpkin, to make it for the holidays. It's a great time to add pumpkin um, into anything that you're making, any dish. So I thought, why don't we just go ahead and add it to our baked French toast. So come on along while I get that going. All right, friends, so the first thing that we're going to be doing is I cracked eight eggs into my bowl, and we're going to go ahead and whisk these up. All right, so to this, we're going to be adding one cup of milk, two cups of half and half, a tablespoon of vanilla, a tablespoon of pumpkin spice, an eighth of a teaspoon of salt, two tablespoons of sugar, and we're going to add one cup of pumpkin puree. I still have pumpkin puree left over from when I baked my pumpkins, so I'm going to go ahead and add that. We're going to go ahead and mix all this together. I want to make sure that pumpkin is well incorporated in. All right, so that is done. So now we're going to do our bread. So here I've got a whole loaf of uh, Italian bread. You can use French bread, Italian bread, any kind of bread that you like, but you want it to be a thicker bread that's going to absorb a lot of the mixture. You don't want to do a thin bread because it's just going to turn into mush. All right, so you want to make sure you, uh, you grease your pan. I've got some nonstick uh, spray here. And then we're going to go ahead and start layering our breads. All right, so now that our, mix our bread is all in here, now we're going to pour in our mixture. And you want to make sure that you get in between all the crevices of the breads just so that everything is evenly coated. All right, so now that our bread is completely co coated with the mixture, now we're going to cover it with foil. Now this is going to sit in your refrigerator overnight. And tomorrow morning when we come back, I'll show you the topping that we're going to put on top, and then we'll go ahead and bake it. So I'll see you all back in the morning. All right, friends, so it's morning time, and I just took our baked French toast out of the fridge. So the next thing we need to do is make our purling topping to go on top. So first I'm going to chop up one cup of pecans into decent sized pieces. It doesn't have to be like super small, just enough. You can definitely make it easier on yourself and get already chopped pecans, but I have a big bag of uh, whole pecans. All right, those are roughly chopped, so I'm gonna put them back in my container. Next, I have two sticks of butter, which is one pound. To this, I'm gonna add two tablespoons of light corn syrup and a cup of brown sugar. One tablespoon of pumpkin spice, and then we're gonna go ahead and uh, mash this up. A fork works best. And you wanna make it a crumble. This is gonna go right on top of the baked French toast. Add in your nuts and it's ready. So now we're going to put it on top evenly across your French toast. All right, friends, get your hands dirty, get in there and spread it all around. All right, so that's exactly how you want it to look. So we're gonna go ahead and put this in the oven, 350 for 40 minutes. You can put a um, baking sheet underneath just to prevent if, if it starts boiling over the butter it doesn't get all over your stove. Or you can do foil at the bottom, um, just so it doesn't get all over your stove. So I'll see you guys back in 40 minutes. All right, friends, so our French toast is done. It took 45 minutes in the oven, and then I let it sit for another 20 minutes. It smells amazing. It definitely smells like fall in here. You can use this recipe anytime, but it's great around the holidays, for Thanksgiving, for Christmas. It's just wonderful to have. So I hope you all enjoy this recipe. I hope you give it a try. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share with your friends and family. As always, I hope all is well and have a blessed day. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along